Folks, if you have Fat Shark goggles, uh, then you need to go watch this video by Rotor Riot about the Fat Shark battery hack. Uh, the long and short of it is that the battery that comes with the Fat Shark goggles is uh, not big enough, basically. It runs out way too fast. It doesn't last for a full day of flying. And especially if you're using one of the diversity modules like LaForge or Furious uh, True D diversity, they're taking it you know, twice as much uh, current as the standard module does or more and uh, just sucks your battery dry. So the, the, the hack involves building your own battery pack out of some standard 18650 lithium cells. And if you want to learn more about that, go watch the, the video, the Rotoriot video. But here's the thing. The Rotoriot uh, video shows that you take this circuit board. This is the circuit board that comes with the Fat Shark battery. You can see they're disassembling it here in the screenshot I've selected. And this is the circuit board with the little LEDs on it where you push the button and it shows you how full your battery is. And, I, you know, I've, I've, I've been asking, well, where do you get that? Because I've been doing this hack for a while. Uh, I was doing this hack before it was cool. You probably haven't heard of it. <laughs> I was doing this hack for a while. Uh, there was a video that uh, was posted. I think the guy who made the video actually helped Rotoriot make this video. But he has a, he's had a video up for a while. And... Um, but I don't have that cool board, that LED board. There you push the button and it shows you how full your battery is. And I asked on the Rotoriot video, where do you get that board? And they said, well, you just take it out of your Fat Shark battery. And I'm like, well, I don't have a Fat Shark battery. Well, you know, so that's the point of this video. Thank you, Banggood. If you're going to do this hack and you don't have a Fat Shark battery to pull the, uh, the, the LED board out of, Banggood has one for you now, and I'll bet they I'll bet they did this specifically because this hack was getting popular. So this is basically you order it, you wire it up with a positive and a negative. You got a little button on the side you push, and the LEDs light up to show you how full the battery is. Boom! There you go, perfect. Now I've got some of these boards on the way. They're not here yet. I haven't had a chance to actually test them, uh, you know, because the slow boat from China, right? But there is one thing that concerns me a tiny bit, and that is this power LED right here. Now, presumably, that means that that's lit up anytime the board is powered, which if you wire this up to your battery pack, it's going to have power always, right? So eventually, that LED would drain your battery pack. Uh, LED, maybe it's pulling 20 milliamps, uh, perhaps. we got a 3,000 milliamp hour battery, so 3,000 milliamp hours divided by 20 milliamps. In 150 hours, it would drain your battery. So maybe you don't care about that, but if you're like me, you kind of don't like little LEDs sitting there sucking power when they really shouldn't be. So if that does turn out to be true, maybe one way to approach this is to simply desolder this LED. Boom, you're done. And then, then it won't be there. So I'll test that out once I get it. But in the meantime, if you want to do this Fat Shark battery pack mod and build your own 3000 milliamp hour battery pack from off the shelf 18650 cells, go ahead, check out this video. They'll show you all the steps for how to do it and entertain you in the process. And if you don't have a Fat Shark battery pack to pull this nice board from, go ahead and get one from Banggood for about $3. Happy flying.